Allez, 3, 2, 1. Hey everyone, welcome back to the Millennial Men channel. Today we'll be doing a comedy reaction from Bill Burr. And the bit name is Walk Your Way Out, Final Solution. Yeah. Let's do it. Think about the population all the times you've been telling on my specials. I'm always talking about it. And I think I got the plan. Because I know, no, no, no. Wait till you hear the plan first, because a lot of people are going to die. <laughs> Before you start hooting and hollering, everybody thinks they're going to fucking make it, right? This is how you do it. Well, this is not how I would do it. Okay, first of all, you got to become a dictator, okay? Because it's too late to try to be like, well, hey, man, maybe just have a couple. It's too fucking late. Someone's got to have the balls to take out the sickle and start chopping some heads. So, here's my idea. I become dictator. When you become dictator, obviously you got to murder everybody in power, right? From the head Logical. all the way down to their goldfish. You got to kill everyone in the family <laughs> so they don't come back for their revenge, like in Godfather 2 or every karate movie you've ever seen, right? <laughs> you got to do it the way the Russians did it, yep. where you don't find the skulls for a hundred fucking years. That's the way you do it. Jesus then you take Christ. control of the media. I keep all of you guys media blacked out. You don't know what's going on unless I want you to know it, right? Big pictures of me. You got to sing songs about me. If there's no passion in it, a black van pulls up and you're never seen from again. All right? <laughs> Figure three to six months of that, everybody gets on the same page, and that's when I'd start thinning it out. Randomly sinking cruise ships. <laughs> Just hear me out. It's the way to go. It's the way to go. You get 2,500 to 3,000 people a whack, and I think it's a really whack. good mix of people to get rid of. <laughs> you know? Think about the kinds of people that take a cruise. These aren't forward thinkers. These aren't seekers. They're not pivotal oh. to our survival. Is that feel like Josh? Josh, my, my family, um, that's like their preferred mode of vacation is cruise ships. So yikes. <laughs> Oof. You going back? Yeah. Yep. They're not pivotal to our survival. Oh. You ever hear somebody coming back from a cruise? It's one of the worst stories you're ever going to hear. Because <laughs> they don't do shit. They don't want to travel to another country, interact with the new culture, try to figure out the train system or the money. All they want to do is just sit on a fucking boat. <laughs> just drinking. That's all they want to do. All right? Worst story you'll ever hear. Hey, how was your cruise? Oh, it was great. I was fucking laying there. There was a DJ over here on the one and the two wooka wooka thing, right? And then they had this chocolate fountain. It was like a fountain, but it was chocolate. You stuck the toothpick in the food, and you stuck it in the chocolate, and you stuck it in your mouth. And then you'd be like, I want another drink. And it gathers in your navel, and you punch yourself. You get in your mouth. Then every day around noon, we line up for lunch. What's for lunch? We don't know. We don't make decisions. Whatever they give us. I like all inclusive. You just have to think once. Can I write that number on this piece of paper? All right. Tell me where to go. <laughs> I'm telling you, if you guys could just get past the humanity of what I am suggesting. <laughs> if you could just get past it and maybe lose a couple of friends here or there. I'm telling you, you wouldn't miss them. You wouldn't. Miss, you know when you'd miss them when you when you went to, when you went to a baseball game and there wasn't those hundred people in the upper deck trying to get the wave going, right? <laughs> you wouldn't have people getting mad because someone's sitting down during a song like that's offensive to me, even though I don't know the issue. Right? <laughs> Nashville, little pulled back on that one. Little pulled back. <laughs> It's about police brutality, it has nothing to do with you and your beautiful white world and mine, right? Just let it go, I don't give a fuck if you watched every episode of McHale's Navy. This is still not about you, it's not a military issue. There you go. <laughs> I'm telling you, you wouldn't fucking order to start sinking these cruise ships and then retire to my chambers with my mistresses and my whores, right? My whore. Just banging away, wearing the whole uniform, the whole dictator uniform, everything except for the pants. Right? <laughs> Compression socks with sock garters just banging away. 
my unearned medals just clanging off my chest. <laughs> <laughs> Bro, why does every dictator have like 60 know, like, medals? Yeah, just <laughs> rows of medals. <laughs> it's like the North Korean, um, all like the generals, they all have like the same yeah. awards, like all just draped out in both yeah, shoulders. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> just rows and rows of them. No way. My unearned medals just clanging off my chest. The big thing is to see how long I could fucking keep the hat on, like, yeah, yeah, yeah. Nah, I can't do that. That breeds resentment amongst you men. You gotta lead them into battle. And I would. I would. I'd have my own sub. All right? I'd have my own sub, and I would hunt these cruise ships on a moonlit summer night. <laughs> That's right. On a moonlit summer night, when sound carries, you know? You know those summer nights when your neighbor's talking about you? doesn't think he can hear him, you're sitting on your porch going like, oh yeah, is that how it is? <laughs> so that's how it is, right? One of those nights. And I'd be a sport about it. I'd surface before I did it. I'm armed, they're not, it's only fair, right? They see me, I give them a little wink, a little nod. I'd have a little Red Baron class. All right, get the fuck out of here, right? But if you didn't see me, it'd be game on. And every moonlit summer night, every summer, I'd go out to harvest, right? That would be the deal. You I would just surface. <laughs> Und listen for the music, yeah? It's <laughs> 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 so stupid. What is this? We say, we say, we say, they are the floorboards, no? They are the floorboards, no? They are the floorboards, no? Yeah. Oh my God, yeah. Und listen for the music, yeah? And then you cruise over, you strafe all the survivors. He's really thought about this. <laughs> the people that were lucky enough to survive. That would be it. 2,500 to 3 <laughs> underwater. All the evidence is gone. All the evidence is gone. Every mass murderer throughout time is fucked up. They did it on land. You're gonna get caught. Where are you gonna put all of that, right? You do it out to sea. It all goes under, you know, nobody knows. I don't know what happened. I have no idea, right? No evidence. No evidence. Maybe, maybe like a flip-flop, right? <laughs> Like an Ed Hardy shirt, just. <laughs> I'm controlling the media, nobody knows about it, right? And as I sank the ships, I would be building exact replicas at the same time, right? So I'd be eliminating people while creating jobs. <laughs> An idea what's going on, only you just realize, like, wow, man, the traffic's easing up. I'm getting into third gear at five o'clock at night. This is crazy. This is amazing. I don't know what's going on, but this bill guy's all right. You know, another buddy of mine got a job building ships. Can you fucking believe that? That industry, it's just blowing up. It's, it's crazy. <laughs> I wouldn't get a job down there. They're paying great, you know, make a little extra money. Then, yeah, who knows? Maybe you and me take a cruise. We'd have a good time. <laughs> that would, that's how it would work. That's how my ethnic cleansing would work. <laughs> it wouldn't be based on rim enough to think that taking a cruise is actually traveling. Technically, you're traveling, you know, but what are you seeing? Just a bunch, look at the water! Oh my God! You can tell that's the Atlantic Ocean. That definitely does not look like the Pacific Ocean. <laughs> so, yeah, look, admittedly, I'm a fucking psycho. And I, I am, dude, I have dreams. I, have this, I had a dream two years ago that still haunts me, you know? You ever have one of those dreams where you think you woke up, but you didn't? 
You know, you're just sitting up and it feels like your house. I had one of those dreams, right? So I just, I sat up in bed and I looked over and there was this little girl in the corner of the room, no idea who she was. She was like three, four years old and she was talking to me, but I couldn't understand what she was saying. She was just standing in the corner just going, I was like, what? What would you say? I, I can't hear you, sweetheart. You got, you got to come a little closer. She walked like halfway to the bed. She's like nodding her head, just going, I What's, Hell no. Yeah. Fuck no. Big, like, the grudge eyes. I'm just, I'm just like, so you, gotta, you gotta come closer. She walks all the way up to the bed. I was just like, I couldn't hear you, sweetheart. What'd you say? What did you say? And she just nods and just goes, you're gonna kill yourself. <laughs> <laughs> I just sat up like... <laughs> <laughs> what the fuck kind of dream is that? Fucking Bill. She just, she just nods it. and just goes, you're gonna kill yourself. <laughs> I just sat up like... <laughs> <laughs> I'm like, no, I'm not. No, I am not. <laughs> my wife wakes up. What's the matter? I'm like, I just had like the most scary dream I've ever had in my life. It was horrible. She's like, was I in it? No, you self-centered jackass. <laughs> Jesus Christ. Not everything is about you, sweetheart. I love you, but it's not all about you. I should... So I'd run into that little girl again so I could just be like, look, you little shit. You don't go around saying that to people. <laughs> now, I'm not going to kill myself. I don't know what that dream meant, you know, because you're dreaming metaphors, man, you know? So, I don't know. It just freaks me out, though, you know? Disturbs my wife and shit, but, you know, there is one good thing about being a psycho, you know? One of the great things about being a psycho is you can spot another psycho from a mile away, you know? That's really great thing. I can spot him, you know? It's, it's in the eyes. Never look at the costume. Nice people costume. look at the costume. They'll see somebody in, like, dad jeans, you know, pushing their kid on the swing, you know, the whole nerdy sweater. Hey, how you doing? You believe the summer's already over? I mean, this is crazy, right? Oh, this one here, this one here's got me running around, you know. She's running the house. She's running the house. <laughs> People always like, oh my God, he's so nice. Such a great family man. And I'm just sitting thinking in my head like, dude, that guy is a fucking psycho. <laughs> a psycho. Look at his eyes. You don't see that? The dude is barely hanging on. He's white knuckling it through all the shit he thinks he's supposed to do. All that fucking guy needs, all he needs, he just needs a little nudge. That's it, just a little nudge. You have no idea what that, that guy's capable of. I would not want to see the hard... Yeah. But I... Damn. I think it was a little more than the, uh, the bit. I think, yeah. I think the ending part, I think that was probably longer, a different but... bit. Uh, yeah. The video was a little weird, it kept cutting. I think they were. I think I'm it was, assuming there's copyright. Copyright. Yeah. They're trying to yeah, hide from I think the copyright was. box. Yeah. Uh, don't it was, it was like every like two yeah. minutes or so, which is like usually like a two minute uninterrupted is when we get copyright. And strike. that whole the whole thing on the bottom is like the best of Bill Burr just kind of continuously yeah. scrolling. Probably Keep probably. in mind, don't grow us in the fucking comments. I clicked this one because this one was 11 minutes. The other one on this was eight minutes, and the last thing I fucking wanted was us to do another halfway bit. So I tried to make sure we had the full one, so I chose the longest one. Okay? So don't fucking, gross the fucking, fucking comments. Fucking deal with it. <laughs> yeah. uh, anyways, I like that. That was funny. Yeah. yeah. It took I a few just, turns dude, there I can there imagine sure. just him on the submarine, just push, push to the last listen, few survivors. Listen for the music. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, his little beat he's making. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, someone should make Dude, our arms look so good in this tag. <laughs> 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 Hello, buddy. Yeah. Um, sweet. I, I I don't know if it's my favorite Bill Burr uh, bit, but it's definitely funny. Yeah. Um. So, it's anyways, uh, comment below if you have anything else or any other Bill Burr that you want us to watch uh, and react to. If you see someone comment something you want us to react to as well, go ahead and give that a like so that way it goes to the top and then we can see it easier. Um, and we know popularity. Besides that, like, comment, subscribe, hit that bell. Ding. And thanks for stopping by the Money Men channel. Peace.